Hey there everyone, welcome back to some more, like Dragon Gaiden, I may not erase his name. Now, we've already, just a quick refresher, we're in Premium Adventure, because we already beat through the main story. Beat through the, uh, Coliseum sub-stories, however, we still have quite a few more sub-stories to go. Yeah, because just from requests, got two, three, four, six, eight... Seventeen. One of which, though, is just getting all the golden balls, which I know we have quite a few right now. Um, four out of seven, so we're still shy three of them. Which I don't know how necessarily we would get them, honestly. So, of course, got catching balls will be kind of a later thing. But this recording is going to be more lax because we're just going to be focusing on uh, requests. So let's uh, let's get to it. Seeking advice from Genta Kusano. 8,000 points. That'll be very useful. Hey, Joryu. You're a guy with a lot of life experience, right? Mm -hmm. A lot of left field there. Come on, indulge me. Yes or no? Well, I'd say my life hasn't exactly been uneventful. Just as I figured. In that case, doling out advice to youngsters should be a piece of cake for you. Mm. You're not telling me that's my next job, are you? Mm. I know you're a jack of all trades, but is it youth outreach a little outside your wheelhouse? No, no, if you're thinking with your humanitarian brain, you gotta think with your business brain. <laughs> If we want to secure our success down the line, we got to market to these young people. They're our future clients. Ah, I see how it is. Mm -hmm. Well, what kind of advice am I supposed to be giving? You're going to have to ask the client about that directly. <laughs> His name's Genta Kusano. The plan is for you guys to meet at Smile Burger, so can I ask you to head uh. over there? You really are relentless. But sure, I'll do it. All right. Just to cut down on time, too, we're gonna go ahead and take the taxi from one point to another. As much as we can. You know, come to think of it, too, one of the golden balls might actually be in Ijincho, in uh, Yokohama. Actually, I should check on the map first. I think there's just the one Smile Burger. Nope, it's that one. Okay. Glad I checked. Otherwise, I'd be sending myself quite a ways away. Perfect. I'm supposed to meet a Kame's client here. Um, sorry, hello. Are you Okami sans? Yep, I'm Joryu. Good to meet you. N nice to meet you too. I'm Kusano. Let's get to it then. Akami tells me you need some advice. Is that correct? Uh, well, about that. I'm sorry for wasting your time. Is it too late to cancel our appointment? I'll pay the full fee and everything, of course. If you're sure, could you at least tell me. Could you at least let me know why you're canceling for reference? Yeah. Well, I was originally hoping to get some dating mm. advice. I see, so your heart's been broken. Sorry to hear, but keep your chin up, champ. There'll be plenty of dating opportunities in your future. <laughs> no, that's just it. My invitation went off without a hitch. Mm. Huh? Well, that's good news. But you must have really wanted help if you were willing to pay, pay us for it. Did you end up getting advice elsewhere? Yeah. Yes, I've got my hands on the best life advisor I could ask for. No other than this here. Chat DDT. Okay. Mm -hmm. Chat DDT. What are you talking about? Mm -hmm. Oh, are you not familiar? Chat DDT is a huge tech breakthrough. We're at the forefront of a new industrial revolution. I think that's a play on Chat GPT. 
Even though it's still so new, that program's attracted so much attention that they started discussing regulations surrounding its use at the G7 Summit. I feel like I'm missing something here, but it seems impressive. Oh, you bet. Shot DDT. Uh, might... Yeah, don't know why I was struggling there for a moment. Chat DDT might look like any other app at first, but it's got the power to answer absolutely any question mm -hmm. you ask it. Okay, yep. It's basically exactly like that. Any question? I mean, it's supposed to. Kusuno, nothing in this world is absolute. Technology can't solve all your problems. You should take care not to treat this lightly. <gasps> wow, you're awfully serious, aren't you? You should really give it a chance, you son. <laughs> Shot DDT's magic sure to dazzle you, and you might uh. learn something. Guess I can't fight the future forever. How do I go about this? Well, first off... So I just say something into my phone? So. Yep, go ahead, ask it anything you want to know. Mm -hmm. Okay, ahem. <clears throat> what exactly is Shot DDT? ChatDDT is a machine learning AI designed to provide highly accurate responses to a wide variety of conversation topics. However, ChatDDT's answers are not 100% accurate. It's important to do your own research and make final decisions for yourself. Mm. That's strange. Did I call their assistance hotline by mistake? Yeah. Nope, you're definitely talking to the program. It listened to your question, then AI came up with a response and read it back to you. Mm. AI? ChatDDT just said it a second ago. Short for artificial intelligence. Artificial. Uh. Okay. Let me see if I can clarify. Um. Oh, robot. It's like a robot. Daddy. What? That was a robot talking to me. Yeah. Uh. Sure. More or less. That's incredible. Go ahead and ask another one. Whatever you're curious uh. about. Hmm. Let me think for a second. Tell me the secret of Cosmo Curious popularity. Any good restaurants around here? Let's go the weird route. What makes Cosmo Curious so popular and cool? Cosmo Curious? Is that supposed to be somebody famous? <laughs> yeah, in this line of work, you'd ha have to be living under a rock not to know that name. Cosmo Curious is an Italian <laughs> chef and restaurant owner based in the Saitama pre Prefecture. Mm -hmm. Wait, what? Last October, his book, Three Minute Recipes for the Time Crunch Chef, made a successful debut. It received a slew of positive reviews praising its atta attentiveness to the needs of business homemakers. On his popular video channel, his positive disposition, upbeat commentary provided widespread entertainment for his 100,000 subscribers. <clears throat> wow, didn't realize I developed such a flourishing culinary career. Oh, I just realized. <laughs> It's a lot less all-knowing than I was led to believe. What is this thing actually useful for? Huh. Well, like I told you earlier, it's great for giving the best romantic advice ever. Then. I'm starting to put the pieces together here. So this is the amazing advisor that made you cancel my services? So it is. See, there's this great gal at my university called Takaishi-san. I just asked Chat DDT what to say to her, and before I knew it, she was saying yes to a date then. with me. Seriously? Oh, I should ask it what to do next. I'm about to go with, out with the girl I like. How should I prepare for our date? If you're about to go on a date with a girl you like, the following points will help you prepare. 1. Practice good hygiene. 2. Suggest co conversation topics you and your date will enjoy. 3. Be polite and demonstrate your best attitudes. Uh. Attributes. But that's the bare minimum. Hold on, just give it a chance. Uh -huh. How do I demonstrate my best attributes? Showing off the best version of yourself is not an easy task in today's age of social media and knowledge distribution. An overload of information can lead to parts of yourself being drowned out among unimportant details. To leave an impression on your partner, you must boldly showcase your personality. Is there a setting you can change to make it less vague? Yeah. No, no, we're getting there. How can I boldly showcase my personality? Oh, it's just going down a rabbit hole. You could try jumping off a bridge. What? <laughs> mm. You could what? River diving from bri bridges is a thrill-seeking practice that has been outlawed in many areas due to high rates of related accidents. 
But that is precisely why doing it may prove your, your resolve. <sighs> is this thing stupid? <laughs> eh. Wow, I never would have thought of that. Nanny. What? Oh no. Boy. Hey, get back here. Kusuno, you idiot. Are you really going to jump into that into a river? He might have canceled the service, but I'm not about to let him risk his life because some program told him to. Holy crap. Yep, looks like he's gonna do it. That's not good. Boy. Kusuno, you're not really planning to jump in, are you? Yeah. Of course. If it's for Takaishi-san, a little river diving is nothing. <clears throat> so you really would do anything if this robot told you to. It's not like that. I weigh the pros and cons and decide this for myself. You're going to get yourself hurt. Not if I do it right. I've got to impress her for that day. Good. Jeez, slow down and use your head, kid. If you land yourself in the hospital, there won't be a date at all. <sighs> Ugh, you're right. I saw a solution and thought, this is perfect. And then... There's got to be a less dangerous way. Well, let me ask again. <sighs> You're gonna ask it again? Even after all that? Hey, Chop DDT is the whole reason I have a date in the first place. How do I show the girl I like that I'm suave and quick thinking? Could try protecting her from an assailant. Such a display of love and decisive action will help to mirror romantic ideals often found in popular media. You'll first need to become entangled with an assailant. Popular media shows us this can be done by making challenging eye contact or bumping into them with your shoulder. <sighs> now it's just encouraging you to be a menace to society. Soko. Oh, so like in that manga I read. <sighs> hey, hold up. <sighs> Kid's a pain in the ass. Not gonna let this drop that easily. I love these side stories for how absolutely ridiculous they can get. Because this is getting absolutely ridiculous. He's gonna get himself hurt. That might as well just keep the Asian style since it swings pretty quick. Try to break a few objects while we're uh going around here. Try to help that checklist a little bit. Huh? Hey shit kicker, watch where you throw your weight. Huh? Oh, you wanna fight, do ya? Huh? Excuse me? You looking to damage that brain case further? God. <laughs> <laughs> that all you can take? One punch? Boy. Sorry to step in, but would you mind letting him off the hook? Huh? Huh? No way. This fucking sardine shoulder checked me on purpose. Uh. You're understandably upset, but it was a momentary lapse of judgment. Don't go too hard on him. Too damn late for that now. I was already feeling real high strung. <laughs> then a perfect punching bag lands right in my lap. Huh? I ain't giving up this chance. Ooh, this guy's actually got some help. Oh, not that much, okay. Finish it on the ultimate counter. Perfect. Huh? <clears throat> you done? Drop the issue and we'll put this behind Boy. us. And you, what do you have to say? I I'm really sorry. Huh? Think twice before you pull that shit again, brat. You've got to stop and think about what you're trying to accomplish here. At this point, I'm starting to think you're the robot. 
But the only reason this girl's even talking to me is ChatGPT. I admired her from a distance. Passive, you know? The only reason I was able to work up the courage to invite her on a date was because of ChatGPT's advice. Look, I'm not gonna tell you to swear off it forever, but it's just a tool. Rethink, rethink how you use it. I'm not that clever. I'm not great with words, and I'm definitely no good at talking to people I'm interested in. Not until Chat DDT. I'll probably be using it for the rest of my life. And that's okay. Nah. I want to confess my feelings to the girl I like, but I'd like to subtly hint that I have something important to tell her just so I don't spring it on her. Let me see if I can help. Do you have any more information about this girl you like? Mm. Um, she's a 20 year old female college student who likes cats and cooking. In order to not surprise a 20-year-old female college student who likes cats and cooking with your confession, you should send the following messages to hint at your feelings. I'm not looking forward to my to our date so much my heart is beating a thousand beats of Meow Newt. If we could cozy up in the kitchen and cook a meal together, that'd be just perfect. Okay, it's giving cat puns here. <sighs> nope, no, no. Those lines go straight into the garbage. Yeah. Too late, just sent them off. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, she replied. She's disgusted, right? You should take this opportunity to learn from you. <laughs> wow, sounds like Ta Takaishi-san is just as excited as I am. She... really? She says, I can't wait for my date with Mew either. And cooking a meal together sounds amusing. Nani. I can't believe this. <laughs> <laughs> See, jory san this is why I love Chop oh. DDT. She really liked it. How does it feel, mm. huh? Uh. Alright, I'm on a roll. Can't stop now. I'm gonna have Chot DDT tell me how to confess to her. See you later, Joryu san. Thanks for the help. I'll send over my cancellation fee later. Well, if he really is happy, who am I to deny him that? Ah, it's not over. I have a feeling she might be using it too. That is my guess. Oh, so this is the first part after uh, the ending. I did want to say too that I, it's kind of leaning more like when I do Infinite Wealth, I'll do the Japanese dub version because, I don't know, it sounds... It sounds more natural, especially for Kiryu sound. And Kasuma... No, Kasuga Ichiban actually sounds pretty good too, from what I've heard in this. Mm -hmm. That's Kusuno. That must be Takaishi. Wait, is he about to confess to it? <laughs> Isn't this romantic, Takaishi-san? Just you and me by the Sotobori River? Huh? Uh, yeah, I guess so. It wasn't until I met you that I realized what a lovely shade of blue this river is. And so being near this beauty with you makes me feel nervous but excited. Um, well... He's probably spouting lines he got off chat GDT. The girl he's with doesn't seem to know how to respond. That's strange. Their messages made it seem like they were hitting it off pretty well. What's going on? You know, just being around you awakens the poet in me. The river is blue. You're sweet, it's true. What do you think? It's, um, cute. Heh. <laughs> this is too painful to watch. <laughs> there's more where that came from later. <laughs> right now, there's actually something what? I want to tell you. Kusano. <gasps> Jijoryu, son? What's going on? You know this guy? Sorry to bother you. I'm an acquaintance of Kusano's. Huh? What are you doing here? <sighs> You're taking your lines word for word from Shati DT again, aren't you? What? Huh? So what if I am? You gonna try and tell me I'm wrong for asking for help? Yeah. No, I'm telling you that genuine communication is better than perfect communication. If you've got something important to say, don't go searching for the cleanest, best edited version. Take a risk for once. Speak from your own heart. I told her to write me a heartfelt confession to Takaishi that should get my feelings yeah. across. I'm trying here. You're just gonna stand there and validate my efforts? What efforts? At this point, you're kidding yourself if you think you're not just a robot listening to another robot's orders. Uh, <sighs> nah. 
Some meat has interrupted interrupted my date. How should I handle him? Good. For the love of That's certainly an issue. A confession of love is a deeply important event in your life. Having it interrupted may seriously affect your future happiness. Based on our previous chat history, you can impress your date and save your love life by beating the intruder with your fists. Huh? You heard the program. Come at me. This will end quick. Oh yeah. <laughs> I thought that's what the heat action would be. Ah, that was awesome. Pant, pant. Kusuno kun, are you are you okay? Did you get out of your system? Uh, um, Kusuno kun, is it true what this man was saying? Your messages and your the lines you you just said to me, all of it was written by Chat DDT. So, uh, tell her the truth. Sorry, he's right. I just didn't want to screw this up. Funny, I've also got something to apologize for, Kusunokun. Don't tell me. Yep, I went to chat DDT for advice too. Uh, of course she did. I had no clue how to respond to the messages I got from you. Yeah. You what? I don't want you to hate me, Kusunokun. So I asked, how should I respond so we get along better? Huh? But really? That explains the enthusiastic responses to his messages. So, I'm sorry, Kusunokun. Looks like I manipulated you into confessing to me. No, not at all. I was going to confess to you either way. Oh. Takashi-san, please, would you go out with me? Yeah. Yeah, I'd love to. Mm. <laughs> so you can do it by yourself. Ah. Yeah, I guess you're right. <laughs> Sorry for causing you trouble. And thanks for helping. Anytime. Keep each other honest now. Will do. You know, ChatDT DDT might have been a useful tool starting out, but I think I don't want to rely on it. I want to figure things out for myself. Then where should we head next? Huh? Huh? Uh, that's yeah. a good question. See, now we're back where we started. You don't have to swear off it. Just rethink how you're using it. <laughs> True enough. Thanks for everything, Jory san Okay. Tell me if there are any good restaurants around here. Yes, mm -hmm. there are. Ah, well if there are, then tell me about them. Sotenbori is well known for being a center of culinary extravagance, boasting a wide swath of famous restaurants. Any one of them is likely to provide a memorable experience yeah. for you. Well, so much for that. <laughs> it's no problem. I know a good hole in the wall we can go. Great, let's head there then. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Things sure do move quickly these days. If ChatDDT had been around when Yumi was alive, what would I have done? Nah, I wouldn't have used it for her. Well, if it was about trying to not to piss off Kashiwagi-san, then maybe. Nice. And her network's level 25, we'll get some cash for her, but that doesn't really matter too much at this point. Only because we have so much money right now. We are flush with cash, and that is totally fine. Well, now time to go get another request. 